Um, also, this is a very exciting video because um, today's video has been very kindly sponsored by a company, and I've just spilled my coffee, <laughs> by a company called Boot Rescue. And they reached out to me to tell me about their boot and their shoe and their trainer wipes. I think they also do them for handbags as well. And basically, they're all natural wipes that will bring the life back into your shoe. So if you've got some uh, suede shoes that are all scuffed up, or maybe you've got some boots that have got salt marks from stomping around in the snow, or if that thing ever happens to you that's happened to me a lot of times where you avoid all the puddles but then you step on a pavement and it makes water squirt out the other side and then your shoe is covered in muddy water. Has it, that ever happened to you? That always catches me out, especially whenever I've been in Manchester, that's a classic. Um, but if any of those things have happened to you or if you've got some shoes that you really love and you want to bring them back to life, then you could investigate these wipes as well. I've been testing them out. So what I'm going to do is at the end of this video, I'm going to show you the Prada trainers that I picked up in a charity shop for four pounds. And I'm gonna show you how I've got on with using these. These are the Sneaker Rescue. And it says scrubs away dirt and scuff marks. And oh, that bit's in French. So I won't read that out because my, <laughs> my pronunciation will be terrible. Um, but yeah, they've also got the Boot Rescue. They've also got um, ones for shoes and handbags, as I say. What I really like about these is they are all natural. It's good to know that they'll be safe to use on the suede because I wasn't quite sure what products to be using. I didn't want to damage those Prada trainers. So we will have a go with those at the end. And I've linked them down below. So if you want to check them out, they're now available on Amazon here in the UK for £6.72 I think is the price and I think that includes delivery. They're on Amazon Prime so you could get them the next day if you wanted to. So now we're going to have a look at the trainers that I use the Sneaker Rescue wipes on. So here's one of them um, that I picked up. So this pair cost me £4 which I thought was such a bargain. I mean they are a little bit worse for wear to be honest with you but they're still in a very wearable condition I would say but as you can see around the toe area the suede's started to get quite stained and there's kind of a yellowy tone all over them. So I wasn't sure exactly how to clean these but I've given them a good going over now that I've got the sneaker rescue wipes. Um, so this is just with one wipe how I've got on so far. I just wanted to let it dry for you so you could see how it's come up. But as you can see, hopefully you can see this, it's become a lot more grey. So the other one was a lot more yellow where there was probably dust or sand on it. I've also gone along the base here because it has a scrubbing side on the wipe. And let's have a look at the toe cap. I might go over this one again, but I think that's come up really nicely. It had some quite big blobs on it that have gone all together. And I've also got in underneath the laces to clean in there as well and on the branding part here. So I do think that they've worked really nicely. The sole along here is looking a lot fresher and up the back there as well. I'll probably go over this one. Let's have a look. That's still looking a little bit yellow there. So I might have another go now just to show you because I know that you want to tune into videos just to watch me scrubbing. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm really pleased with how they've worked actually. So let's just tell you how many you get in a pack. You get 15 wipes, so I would say one or two is going to be good to bring a pair of trainers back to life. So it's quite good value if you work it out. And if you went through your whole shoe collection, you could just dedicate like a afternoon or just do this while you're sitting watching the television. Um, so this wipe, let me show you. So this side's got like a textured um, edge to it and then it's got a smooth side. So with the textured part, you can go over and buff off all of the uh, plastic parts if they need a bit more of a vigorous um, go on them. And then for the bits where you want to um, just remove some stains, you could use the smoother part or you could mix and match it. I mean, I think the rough part's probably okay to use on the suede as long as you're gentle. Um, so yeah, I think um, well worth investigating these. I like the idea as well that the boot ones will remove um, salt stains as well. So you know when you've gone out in the snow and you've got those horrible like white marks, I think the lady who created the company um, developed them originally because they come from Canada. So I think from stomping around in the snow and getting all of the um, snow stains on boots inspired her to come up with a solution for them. They also have a few um, good care tips on their website as well that's worth having a look at. Things like um, trying to get rid of the salt stains quite quickly when you've been um, in the snow in the winter rather than them letting them set in to damage the suede or the leather. I mean, that is the trouble with suede shoes, isn't it? We absolutely love them, and suede boots and suede jackets and suede handbags, but then the minute it rains, we're panicking. So I think 
To know that you've got a little wipe at home to sort it out the minute you get in, if you have um, encountered that, or if you've encountered a spillage, because if you do watch my Instagram stories, you'll see that quite regularly I encounter a little coffee stain on my clothing. I've actually started carrying some, um, some anti-stain wipes for clothes with me, which I know is quite extra, but the amount I'm getting through, it seems quite um, worth it. <laughs> and it's really useful for when I'm on shoots as well, um, because if anyone does get a little stain, and you can guarantee that you're gonna get a stain on yourself at the worst time ever. It's always gonna be when you're going to something important and not when you're just popping to the supermarket. Yeah, obviously this is wet now, so um, I can't show you kind of exactly how that's come up, but you can see all the, I don't know if you can see actually. Can you see that? But you can see all the dirt comes off onto the wipe. So before you think about throwing out any of your shoes, um, maybe consider getting some of these and you could give your whole shoe collection or handbag collection a little refresh. Um, so a great way to um, get some more life out of these shoes that we've already got. I've also just started on my Stan Smiths, which I wear to death. And I was actually thinking of getting a new pair of these because they weren't looking too fresh, but there's nothing wrong with them. And so as you can see on this one, the dirt just seems to collect under here and they just start to look a bit yucky around the edges um, where I just wear them all the time. Just been over this one with one wipe and you can see already that that's come up really nicely. It's got rid of the huge black blotch in there and yeah, I might just pop these shoelaces in the washing machine and these are looking a whole lot better. But yeah, that is everything. Thank you very much to Boot Rescue for sponsoring this video and I really hope that you enjoyed it.